Hello, I am Shubhashish Datta, Chief Scientist at Discovery Semiconductors. Today I will talk about our dual polarization coherent receiver lab body. The coherent receiver lab body is comprised of a dual polarization 90 degree optical hybrid that is integrated with four linear balanced receivers. The lab body accepts an optical signal and an optical local oscillator as its inputs and demultiplexes the signal into its two polarizations and their in-phase and quadrature phase components. So the resulting XI, XQ, Y, YQ channels are the orthogonal uh, channels within the optical signal. This lab body can be used to characterize several modulation formats which include 100G, 25 uh, gigabaud dual polarization QPSK as well as 400G, 16 qualm over two polarizations and two subcarriers. The lab body contains several features that allows the user to optimize the link performance depending on their transmitter as well as backend electronics. More specifically, the gain of the four photoreceivers can be varied by almost 40 dB by using this dial. The gain can be operated in a fixed mode or an automatic gain control mode. In AGC mode, the output of each of the channels is maintained at 500 millivolt peak-to-peak -peak differential irrespective of the input optical signal power. Such a feature is very useful to maximize the e-knobs of back-end digitizer circuits. Also, the transfer function of the four channels can be optimized and chosen between seven bandwidth settings by using these two switches for best matched filtering. Finally, the photocurrents on all the four channels can be monitored by using this BNC breakout box. Such a uh, measurement is very useful when one has to look at arbitrary modulation formats that may not necessarily have symmetry between the in-phase, quadrature phase or the two polarizations. The coherent lab body can be used in a variety of test setups including intradyne, heterodyne and homodyne systems. Here we are going to test this dual polarization receiver uh, using a low phase noise self homodyne test setup. The, t the setup starts with a low phase noise CW laser which we have developed internally. The output of this laser is split into two parts. One of the parts is routed through a polarization maintaining fiber and acts as the optical local oscillator input to the lab body. The other part is routed through a dual polarization IQ modulator which is driven by 25G pattern generator. The resulting optical QPSK signal is brought through a standard single mode fiber and acts as the optical signal input to the lab body. Due to the low phase noise of our um, setup, we are able to use a sampling oscilloscope, not a storage scope, to look at stable constellations. What we have here on the screen is a 25G QPSK constellation where we are looking at the XI channel versus XQ channel. Similar constellation can be seen by looking at the Y polarization as well. Also an advantage of such a DSP free setup is we are able to look at the true time BER with PRBS31 pattern. Here is a sample of the results that we have taken uh, with this lab body. As can be seen all the four bit error ratio performances of the four channels are similar owing to the inherent symmetry of the four balanced receivers in this lab body.